Alright, quickly, come on. I know I just grabbed you out of the blue book enclosure, but the zookeeper told me that our poor little girl is sick. We've gotta go check on her. It's the first time we've had any of our dinosaurs ill. Thanks for the report. Alright, let's see. Charity, are you not feeling good? Yeah, she certainly doesn't look well. Let's see what we can do for her. Alright. We gather a sample. Oh, still girl, whoa, watch the tail, watch the tail. Alright. Now let's see. Let's get it back in the lab. samples, huh? Okay. Could it be the banana leaf plant? Could it have caused it? There's a lot of things in here. Hmm. And nice some of the feces left over. What else? something in the water? No. Oh, look at the baby. It's okay, little one. We'll cure your mama. They've been doing so wonderfully lately. Maybe the leaves haven't been kept well enough. I just hate hearing an animal in pain. Alright, I think we've got all the samples that we're going to get. So let's hurry back over here. Can we get a cure? Ah! How on earth do we get a cure so that we can make sure that she's okay? New cure, new cure. Oh, hang on, Charity. Trouble. And this place is such a wreck. I think I don't think the zookeepers can keep up with them. Just the amount of everything anymore. Oh girl. <sighs> How do I cure you, honey? I know, I know. What a time for an email. Researchers at the local science museum recently came across a collection of fossil pieces in storage. They need your help to put these fossils together. They know the fossilized bones are from Awara. If you assemble the pieces in one month or less... Just assembly? Man, that's lucky. We need some money, especially because I... I just don't feel like... Analyzing. No, still nothing? Still nothing? The quaggas. Uh, there are some evil germs afoot here, and we're gonna find out what it is so we can take care of our. Uh, uh. All right, let's get to work. We've gotta take care of our girl, you know. I'm really thinking that maybe we shouldn't have fired so much of the staff by now. It's kind of creepy to just be able to stand on the floor like this. Here, here, here. How are we going to help her out? I'm 
so worried. I don't know what to do. I know I probably shouldn't say that in front of you, but come on. It's pretty much just us left. Okay, let's dive in. specific. Let's see, disease curing. You know, never throw away your textbooks. You never know when they're going to come in useful like this. Yes. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Alright. Ah! blue bucks are getting very unhappy. Man, everything's just going to pieces so fast. This is what happens when you fire so much staff. It just doesn't end well, you know? Let's see. They're breeding so quickly. That's part of the problem. Let's see the flower grow up. We're gonna create a few of them. And then... Where? And get them ready to be sent out. I know, Charity, I know, I'm coming. Alright, come on. Let's gather up the blue bucks. Jump in there, it's a rodeo. We have to make sure we can ship some of them out. They're just breeding so fast that we can't keep up with it. And the jaguars look like they need attention. Oh, man. If only we were bringing in more money. Crap, and we, we promised that we would go and put all of those... invest in some more zookeepers. I'm coming, Charity! I'm coming! Uh, hang on. What? Guess needs more? Wah! This place is a wreck. Charity, how can I help you? Gotta get in the gate. This is disgusting. I may assign you to permanent poop scoop duty until we can get more zookeepers in turn. Be aware of this. <sighs> Charity! Jeez, just don't wait. Charity! There you are, honey. Okay. Just to put all the poop. Where on earth would we- a trash can? That's literally all we've got right now. Trash can. Oh, hey look, they're playing with the bones. No? No? Not a trash can. An organic process could help turn the poop into something useful. Oh dear. Uh, I think that they are talking about getting a compost building. 
Okay, I think we'll be able to handle that. And you know what? We need to hire more staff. It just it just can't be just us anymore. Alright. Let's see. Packer assigned there. Good, there's got there's more people wandering further in. And we are actually gonna get ready to expand over here, so I think just those two will be good for her. I know, Charity, I know, we're working on it. What else were we supposed to be working on, intern? Are you taking notes? I hope you're taking notes, because today's been kind of hectic. I, I don't know if you feel that way, but I'm definitely feeling the hectic. It's definitely, like, top-level hectic. By the way, check out the quagga. Um, I, uh. Hi. Hi, baby. They're doing pretty well. Turns out that they can also be housed with zebras. I've heard excellent cases of that happening in the other zoos. Really pretty up here, isn't it? Look at all the plants we've put in. People really seem to love the quagga. Neither of these guys are too healthy. That's our fault. We just weren't able to reproduce them as carefully as we needed. And man, do you ever feel guilty about that, too? Here we are, messing with genetics and, and you know, playing God, basically. And then... You know, you screw up on matching up the telomeres and all the bits and pieces. Uh, it, it can be really humbling. Alright, compost building. Let's stick this sucker somewhere where it's not gonna bother anyone. Off in a corner, maybe. Actually, you know, if we kept it by the research center, it would make sense. Life is busy lately, life is busy. But you know, hopefully this just means that we'll get closer and closer to more success. Now let's see if we can get back to curing Charity. Hang on, Charity. Okay. Compost, compost. Excuse me, dude. Goodness, we finally found a cure for her. Whoa, and we got like this huge boost in money for finding a cure. I'm coming, honey. Hey, Charity. Hey, honey. There we go. Hang on. You feel better? Do you feel better now? I think she does. Oh, what a relief. That was really that was really exhausting. I've never had to cure a dinosaur from scratch before. Oh, look at you. You're awesome. Wow, run away. He's gonna trample us. Phew. What do you mean Charity is diseased? I thought we cured her. Did we cure her? I think we did. Okay, good. This enclosure is much too small for them now. They're just breeding so quickly, you know? Why don't we expand it, and then... Then you and I are gonna sit down and possibly talk shop about what we need to do with the zoo. You've been here for several months now, intern. I think we've actually had you for almost a year now, yeah? And I am ready and willing to hear any opinions that you may have over what you think would be a good way to take the zoo from here. Like, where, what directions? If you think that we need to focus on more of this, more of that... Here, I want to know what you've learned so far. Gotta take care of the, the people who uh, come to admire the zoo. That's definitely a very, very big, important one. And let's just talk about this like that. And open up. Free, my little ones. Happy, happy times. Now, let's give you guys, because you're somewhat bored, some more to do. There's that. Here's another salt lick. There's enough of you you probably need. Uh, and let's move this food tray over here. There, that should give them plenty of space to 
continue growing their little herd. These guys are still complaining about not having enough room. I think it might be time to say goodbye to one of them. Probably. What? Miranda's giving birth again. Miranda! Please! What is with all this poop? Oh my gosh, where are my zookeepers? Why are they not keeping on top of this? Yes, I'm aware we have a little bit of time. Hi! Yelling at me, little noisy Hi! I can yell back at you. What? Twins again? Miranda, honey! up with uh, quite a few balloons to sell. It's very nice that people bring balloons. Alright. How's everybody doing? Doing good? Doing good? The zoo's actually starting to travel over the people, but isn't that exciting? Let's walk down to the jaguar enclosure. Let's see how these babies are doing. Make sure they've got food. We should put a proper water pen in here for them. Hi guys! Oh, look at the baby run towards its parent. There's mama feeding the babies. That's just that's just too awesome. Listen, you can hear it purring. I'm just going to pull her a little bit. Excuse me, honey. Didn't mean to disturb you guys. Just for trying. I was trying to keep it nice tidy. Which is apparently impossible for my zookeepers to do. They're enjoying their bucket. Wonderful. Wonderful good. Good, 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 good. The quagga are probably doing well. Why don't we stick a female zebra in there with them? Just because we can. Just because we can is actually a horrible, horrible way to do zoo management. But I'm thinking that the folks who come will really appreciate being able to see uh, both... Oh, I forgot about that! <sighs> Quagga 1 is now pregnant. By the way, Quagga 1, we are going to rename you Jennifer. And we're going to name your mate... Let's see. Let's name him Jerry. Because why not? Ah, this place needs cleaned up. But that's okay, we can run in and do these things really fast. Oh, the blue buck population is ready to... We're going to take you. I stay on top of those blue bucks, they just breathe like a bat. Alright, so the crises have been averted. We've been expanding and releasing and letting letting Leonis go and adding to the closures, making everything happy, happy and good. Whew. It's been pretty busy, hasn't it? Let's see, what else do we got? I just got this message in my email account saying that we've been given permission grants to open some new areas, new new items to help us out. Mary! Mary, okay, you're not a blue buck, I feel better. Mary is now expecting, the boss after population is growing. Let's see, let's see, let's see, where was I? That was over here. Alright. Oh yeah, I've been meaning to put this in for a while. It's an education center about the fossils. Isn't that just perfect? We should put it right down next to where the digging center is. Oh, that reminds me. Hmm. Okay, good. Alright, I see, I see. So what we're gonna do... Um, there we go. Education center. We're gonna put it right over here. I can't remember if we still have an educator on staff. Well, it's been a year already! Oh my gosh, can you believe that? I, I really can't. I mean... We've been here together for a whole year, working hard on all these pieces. That's just wonderful. Basil is going to take over teaching from this podium, I hope, so that we can have our guests who have found. 
our guests who have found fossils over here in our fossil digging play pit come over here and build those fossils. So it should be quite fun. See? She's already headed over there, I'm pretty sure. Yep, education, extinct education center. Okay. Meanwhile, you know, having a bathroom over here probably would be a good idea. Because things are getting a little more crowded. Can we put a bathroom over by the car? Maybe a smaller one. Voila. Whoop. Hang on, another email. The Axel Charitable Foundation has declared your zoo eligible for their matching funds program, which helps our newer or smaller zoos. If you can raise more than $6,197.74 in donations during the next 30 days... <laughs> uh, well, we'll try it out. I don't think we're gonna get there, though. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So far we raised zero dollars. I suppose we should, like, work on having more places for people to spend money. Wouldn't hurt to have some eateries out this far, away from the other stand. Let's see, let's see. Why don't we have a hamburger, hamburger stand over here? Oh, Mary's building a nest for her young already. I can't believe things, the like, time is just flying by that fast. It's just, oh man, it's just amazing. Alright, let's put that there. Maybe a coffee stand. Yeah, just some different things. Coffee stand here. Some nice tundra. Let's put it there, and that there, and then there, there, there. Good. And there we go. Nice plant. Look at that. We've got a fossil. That is pretty awesome. And Mary has now laid an egg. Go oh, Mary, your family's growing so much. So proud of you. So proud. And we're desperately poor again. Do do do. We can help out with this. Help out taking care of our animals. Oh, crisis is averted. Now we just have to figure out how to make some better money. Like I said, in turn, you're really you're coming along in experience. So if you have any ideas, any concerns, then just let me know. We'll figure this out. Our zoo is getting there. We're improving things. Hi guys, hope you're having a good time. Hope you're having a good time. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm kind of exhausted. That was pretty, uh, pretty exciting there to try to take care of everyone all of a sudden. Oh, by the way, did you notice? While you were away on your weekend uh, vacation, we have improved the entrance. Look at all those cars! Awesome! See? We've added some stone, replaced the sand with some good cobblestone, and put in some flowers and pretty plants for decoration. Very nice, very nice. Quite proper. Quite proper. Alright, so you go get some rest. <sighs> These guys are rapidly growing up. I think we'll keep, keep this one. Is that another egg? No, it's a poop. Never mind. <laughs> they look the same from afar. They look the same from afar. Wait, why are you mad? Why are you mad? I can fix things. I can fix lots of things. Are you are you hungry for dessert, little girl? Come this way. I'm not gonna drop you in the Velociraptor tank. Don't worry. I'm actually gonna take you over here. There you go. Have some dessert. I have to sprinkle some ice cream around, huh? Oop. Oh, are you adding another bone? Nope, she's just learning about the extinct animals. Wonderful. See, things are really coming along. Really, really coming along. I think we'll do quite well. Under the arch, isn't that awesome? That's awesome. We're thinkers. Does it work? Or through the arch? That totally works. Totally works. Good. There we go. See, 
see, things are really starting to look nice, at least on one side of the zoo. You go get some rest. I think actually, holy cow, we just may raise enough in, in donations and in money that we'll have that matching zoo fund. The animals are, are pretty content. They're not unhealthy. We've got all this open space now. Look at how much happier they are. That makes me feel so good. And it's big enough, and they're herbivores, that we can probably just keep expanding it and adding more rainforest um, dinosaurs that are, you know, dinosaurs that are compatible with the rainforest. So, ah, that makes me happy. What does the compost bin do, anyway? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. okay. All right, will you go get rest? I know I need to get some, get some rest. That was pretty exhausting, worrying quite a bit about these guys. Their, their enclosure's looking much better now, too. <sighs> and like I said, just leave any comments that you've got, because you've been here a year now with us. Any concerns, any comments, I'm willing to listen to them if you're willing to do the work, okay? Leave them on my desk. Go get some rest.